welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video in today's video we are gonna turn gray hair black now this is an homemade mix of a hair mask that is gonna help to strengthen your hair moisturize your hair it is good for a split end but most of all it is also good to cover your gray so if you're looking for something quick something easy but something very effective to use on your hair to temporarily cover your gray hair this hair mask is for you so follow me to the kitchen and I'll show you how to prepare it I will also give you some tips and how to use it on your hair for best results so let's go do this so our first ingredient might be very surprising to you but this is banana a very very ripe banana now bananas are great for your hair and scalp they help to improve manageability and shine they also help to prevent and control dandruff and moisture on your scalp bananas are rich in potassium natural oils carbohydrates and vitamins which help to soften the hair and protect the ear natural elasticity preventing split ends and breakage banana is also great for gray hair when you mix the banana with any form of a dye it will help the hair to remain black for much longer definitely an amazing ingredient to use on your hair overall so what I'm going to be doing with the banana, I'm going to peel and then I'm going to chop the banana in small pieces for easier blending. At this stage, if you do not have a blender, you can go ahead and use a fork to crush the banana. Now, once the banana is chopped, what I'm gonna do next, I'm gonna reach for my blender and I'm gonna place the chopped banana in the blender. Over and blend. Now take a look at the blended banana. Now after blending, our next ingredient is coffee and here i have some blended coffee beans and i'm going to use about two tablespoons of the blended coffee beans next i'm going to reach for another ingredient which is lemon and lemon is what is going to activate the mixture in this recipe so i'm going to cut a lemon and i'm going to use about a teaspoon of the lemon juice in the mix so so far i have banana i have coffee and now i'm squeezing lemon juice in lemon is acting as a form of acid to neutralize the next ingredient which is charcoal and i'm going to use one teaspoon of charcoal in the recipe pour this in and what i'm going to do next i'm going to cover and i'm going to blend a second time now if you do not have charcoal you can substitute the charcoal for enna it's going to give you the same result so just blend and once this is done and here it is and this is your banana charcoal hair dye and we're going to pour this in a bowl and you want to make sure to get everything out so we're going to do some scraping so just scrape it out in the bowl. Don't forget to get those from the cover. Scoop it out. And now we're gonna give another mix. Take a look at this up close. Very creamy or very rich looking and extremely black. So what we're doing here, we're making sure that everything is fully blended well. And what you're going to do with this, you are going to cover and you're going to leave this on your countertop, preferably overnight for the ingredient to infuse. 
the acid from the lemon is gonna neutralize everything and that is how you are gonna create your natural homemade hair dye for getting rid of gray hair now this can be used anywhere that you have gray hair you can use it on your chin hair you can use it on your head you can even use it you know wherever you have gray so what we're gonna do we're gonna use a brush for the application and take a look at the brush I'm using so just dip the brush in and apply it to anywhere you are looking to cover your gray once you apply it from the root all the way to the tip of the hair you are gonna let it sit on your hair for about an hour another easy way to do this is to apply it to your hair if you're applying it on your head and you're gonna cover with a steam cap you're gonna go under a hair dryer or just walk around with it on your ear for about an hour or two and then you are gonna rinse out now be mindful that this might make a mess in your bathroom so get ready to wash it after so just rinse um, your hair after you rinse first then apply your regular shampoo and rinse a second time now once this is done you're gonna notice that your hair is totally black you can choose to repeat this like within two to three days and then after that you repeat it once per week for best result remember this is just an homemade temporary fix it's not permanent so it's not gonna keep your gray hair looking black for a long period of time so use the treatment at least once per week if you're looking to just simply cover your gray hair and you can store the leftover in the refrigerator for you know up to about seven days so there you have it thank you all for watching please don't forget to like comment and subscribe also if this was your first time watching don't leave without hitting the subscribe button and also that little bell at the side click on it so that each time i upload a video you will get a notification right away thank you all for watching and i'll see you all in my next video bye bye Don't forget to tune in every Sunday for our live show, Sunday Chit Chat with Chitty Beauty at 4.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and at 1.30 p.m. Pacific Time. We also have a Friday show, Let's Talk Skincare with Chitty Beauty. This is on every Friday at 1.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and 10.30 a.m. Pacific Time. You can also follow me on my other social media. I'm on Facebook, Chitty Beauty, Instagram, underscore Chitty Beauty. I'm also on Twitter as Chitty Beauty, and I'm also on Snapchat. So check out my other social media platforms.